All right, guys, what's going on today? Steve Mingle Co. with Final Web Design coming at you with another video. Today I want to talk about the current state of web development and kind of where things are right now and what's kind of going on with the whole web market and websites in general. Final Web Design, this is Steve. So just to be clear, um, the last two, three years, things have changed significantly. There's been a huge push for everything digital, everything digital as far as businesses, uh, schools, government. I mean, when everything happened in 2020, basically everybody was put into a position where everything was going to be had to be done digitally as in the case that people weren't able to get together and things like that so that made a big boom as far as how many people were going to be building their websites and having to convert from this brick and mortar type situation to more of a digital online solution and what i could say is that during that time we just saw everybody was calling i mean everybody needed a website everybody needed something to get their their business you know out there to the public because clearly people weren't able to um get together and meet and that caused a lot of issues so basically at the current state of web design is that we're kind of just past that peak and things have just kind of gone over into a place where the world's open back up people are going back out but at the same time technology and the use of iphones and the use of mobiles and kind of where things have gone has changed a lot as well so with that being said, I would say um, the current state is that we just got over that huge hump of everybody going digital, but now we're in a position where all these businesses that were going digital are going to start to need redesigns, updates, maintenance, things like that that are going to then push the business to the next uh, users or the next stage of development. So what are a lot of these businesses using? I would say a majority of businesses right now are using the WordPress platform. Why the WordPress platform? First of all, it's popular, it's open source, so there's a lot of people who use it. It is professional, it is built so that businesses and small business users are then able to to maintain and update content and images and things like that it is mobile responsive so things like iPhones and tablets and all those will be able to use your business so the current state is that a lot of these people now have moved to a WordPress CMS a majority are using WordPress I would say about 70 percent of our clients if not you're using a application which is usually a view or a react um, that's the majority of what I see out there so people are getting into redesigning their sites and having them updated and maintained. And that's what we're kind of finding right now is a lot of that these businesses that are contacting us are trying to bring their site to the next level now that they have kind of a, a platform started. So that kind of gets as far as what technologies are being used. But there's also become an issue with just how competitive the online market and the online space has become. Uh, you know, there's only so many Google search results that are able to show and people are fighting very, very aggressively for these positions because when you rank up highly, you're clearly going to get a lot of business. It's just the, the nature of Google. Now, there's a lot of ways to help push your business and your website up in those and we can get into those as far as SEO and, you know, even Google ads and things like that. But overall, there has become a huge competitiveness within the digital marketing space and the whole web presence area that is, is become increasingly difficult to, to rank and to grow, especially with some of these businesses that have been doing stuff for 10, 15 years. So I would say right now we're peaking at competitiveness. If you want to be at the top of your search algorithms for your keywords in your business, things are, are definitely a lot busier and a lot more companies now that everything has gone digital. So we've also seen this whole, you know, you want to have your own business website. Now the reason you're gonna to wanna to have your own business website, you can do the Facebook page, you can do the Instagram page, all those things are great and you should have those but at the end of the day you don't control those all that you very much control or all that you do control is your business website if facebook goes down tomorrow or instagram deletes your page tomorrow 
those outlets are gone. You have nothing. You know, you're at the mercy of them. So a lot of businesses are trying to build their own online websites because they want to have that control to then connect with all of those other uh, outlets out there, but bring them back to their website. And we're finding more and more that without your own online digital presence, you're going to find yourself in a position where you're not able to ultimately grow your business because you are relying on other people and other businesses to grow your business where you need to focus on your business and your website to then grow those other outlets so that's just one case right there um and then that gets into kind of the whole seo and how a lot of these businesses now are getting into the whole competitive space and and when you do link things like that and create new uh, social media outlets and such, you're able to then bring that traffic and those sales and those leads over to your current website. So with that being said, this is basically where things are in August, September of 2022. It's only going to continue to grow. We're seeing more and more people reaching out saying that they need to get their online presence started. And uh, with that being said, guys, that's what we're here to do to help you. So if you do need any help, if you have any questions, if you want any assistance, if you just want us to look at your website and kind of tell you where you're currently standing, as opposed to all these other businesses out there, let us know. We'd be happy to do it. Uh, and with that, guys, a like and subscribe. That stuff helps. And we will catch you in the next video. Peace.